Okay, so before we start, I just need to announce that there is now a menu translation patch for Super Thracia that you can play. You can find the download link in the description. It was made by Mia, really good work, done really quickly, like within a week. This episode was recorded before the translation patch happened, so it will still be in Japanese, but now you know it's out there. Do keep in mind that this patch needs to be applied to a clean Thracia ROM, and not one that already has a Super Thracia patch applied to it. Just thought I'd warn you, just in case. What's going on everyone? Welcome back to Super Thracia Chapter 3. This time we are taking on the chapter with the castle, and uh, it has the final boss in it. <laughs> I don't know why, it just has the final boss with it. He has 17 magic, and 30 skill, and effectively 29 defense, and a tome with 100 hit and 1-3 range. I think this is stone. It probably stones me. And then I think a fortify staff, and then he has a what looks like a berserk staff to me. I'm not sure, but I think that's what it is. Yeah, this is gonna be fun. I also know that there's usually in vanilla there's like a bishop here that will come into this door, open it up with the door key, and then open the chests up, and one of the chests has like a meteor, so I'm expecting this guy to get like a fendry or something, because this is a uh, Basically a Dark Mage. I think in this game it's called a Lopter Mage, but it's a Dark Mage. He's gonna Fenrir me probably. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna have to hurry up and take him out. Uh, we got a couple kids inside. We probably want to rescue these. They look a little different. Um, she looked different at least. She looks kind of cool. I like this a lot. Uh, the rest looks the same. Okay, we gotta get these to these houses over here. Uh, I also noticed, uh, when screwing around that, um, Arden is here. And, uh, Arden is here. And uh, Arden is here, and this time he has a Brave Sword, I think. Brave Swords hits twice, I think. Yeah, uh, Charm, Vantage, uh, the Brave Effect. Yeah, that's that's fair and balanced. Uh, everything else looks kind of normal. I mean, they're a power crep, but so is everything. I've been told, I've been told that I'm supposed to disarm some people. <laughs> I've been told. Uh, at least at the end of this chapter. Like, I'm gonna... Uh, Next chapter is going to be the Master Arch. There's going to be a lot of reasons to disarm people, but let me just let me just play normally for like one turn and see what happens. All right, uh, I think I have a good suspicion of what's about to happen here. We're we're about to see some funnies here. Uh, I'm gonna move Marty up here. I'm gonna be taking care of these enemies. Um, I, for, I already forgot which items should be here. Right there it is. Okay, this is. Let's see. Okay, we'll just equip this for now. That should be fine. Uh, let's go in with Avel. And let's move Leaf and friends all up ahead. See what's going on. Oh, by the way, we have uh, Lithus now too. I kind of forgot to show him last time. I was doing the preview, sneak preview. Uh, but he's got the he's got all the weapons that he had when we captured him. Based same inventory, so that's logical. I uh, got slightly better stats. His strength looks pretty shitty by this game standards. But I'm sure the stealing will be helpful at the very least. Uh, he has a, I think this is a door key with him. That's kind of interesting. The fact that he has a lockpick and a door key. I don't know what's up with that, but. I guess we're gonna need him. Uh, we have Safi here again. Uh, she has the hammer and staff, which I assume is gonna be very handy in this one. I don't know if we're gonna get warp. Uh, she's got Miracle. I hope I'm never gonna need it, but probably will. Uh, might be able to get her to like capture bait some people. Like if I can get one of these artists to come out and like capture bait. I'm assuming they behave the same as the artist from chapter one, where if we just attack him once, he's gonna murk us, but we'll see. Uh, let's just play this turn out normally, see what happens. Uh, like I said last time, I, for some reason I thought this was the Luna manual. It's not, it's the Nihil manual. I'm actually going to give it the leaf. I forgot to use it turn 1, but I'm sure we'll get an opportunity to use it later. There we go. I'm getting used to these menus. Oh, movement star, right, she has that. This is basically Ronan. This is basically Ronan Plus. Uh, unfortunately, I can't really make use of this movement star right here. Okay, let's, let's see what's, what's about to happen turn 1. Oh, they move. Oh, shit. They, all, they move from the start. I mean, the last Arden did too, so that's logical. I do want to hurry up and fight the, the boss. I might just leave all animations off for this one. I love the animations, but good god, they, they take a while. Although, I would like to see Birdo's animation. God. Alright, good job, Marty. We're, you're doing good. You're doing good work. Let's go. Go, Marty. Apparently, he has 5% speed growth in this. In vanilla, he has 10%. So they have the speed growth. But everything else is, of course, improved. Uh, didn't get speed, go figure. Uh, good defense though. I might give Luna to him once I get it. Alright, here we go. Yep, Berserk, that's what I thought. That's his only use. And we don't have a Restore Staff, so... He's gonna ruin us now. That's fun. So I know in, in Thracia, the way Staff Targeting works, 
generally is um, it measures how much HP every unit has. It's a very complicated measure. And it will target the one with the most HP. So in my case, that's Dagdar. So if I disarm Dagdar, he should go for him anyway, despite the fact that he won't have any weapons. And uh, also Leaf, even if he has the high HP, doesn't get targeted. I think the game treats him as having like 0 or 1 HP. That also helps. And he also doesn't want to target people with the anti-death flags, which is Avel. So that's going to help too. So let's uh, let's go back to the start. Uh, this time we're going to disarm Dagdar. Uh, I'm just going to give this good access to Orson. This is Orson, right? Yeah. I'm going to give this good access to Orson. Um, oh, I'm going to use these menus. Uh, give me that... Brave Axe for sure. I'm supposed to put that on him anyway. And I guess I'll give him another Iron Axe. Who, who's gonna take the rest of it, I wonder. Uh, Marty could use an Iron Axe, I guess, so... I guess we'll do it like this. Uh, just give all that... Oh wait, he doesn't have an Iron Axe anymore, shit. Whatever, uh, just give off all the... Yeah, give it all away, give it away. And then... Yeah, it should be fine, that should be fine. Yeah, it should be fine. Um, we'll give the Vulnerary to... Give it to Vulnerary. No one really does. We'll just, we'll just figure it out. Nice one, Apel. Very useful. Very cool. Uh, we're gonna give Nihil to Leaf now, turn one. Because uh, he's gonna be good with it. Use that. This one? Yep, this one. Okay, Nihil to Leaf. Now enemy skills won't affect him at all. And that's definitely gonna be helpful. I should give him an Iron Axe for sure. Is there a way to do that? There probably is. That's... Take this from him. And uh, I kinda want Finn to hurry up though. So whatever, it can it can it can stay the way it is right now. Okay, take this. We'll figure this out, no worries. Alright, there we go. Thank god for Thracia trading, right? Give Marty that iron axe he's been longing for so hard. Okay, now see if he can live the Marty. I mean, he already couldn't, but I just want him to be accurate. I just want my boy to be accurate. Uh, now that she has a movement star, we can actually move her like even closer to Arden. Arden squad. Let's see if that helps any. I mean, they're gonna have like 99 move if I hit him, I think. Oh, the bandits already spawned? Did they do that last time? I don't remember that. Okay. I feel like we might need some capture baiting with Safi to get rid of these Ardens. That's are a little bit too high for my liking. Alright, let's go Marty. Let's get partying. Okay, at least there's no fog this time. Fog, I feel like, just kind of extends the, the time it takes to beat the map because you don't know exactly where you want to go next. But it doesn't actually make it too much harder, it's just... It's just more bullshit. So it's exactly the Thracia, Super Thracia philosophy, I guess. Is it me or does this guy have way too much movement? Um, okay, there's the Berserk. It's Dagdar, that's fine. He's disarmed, so... He'll just chill here and do nothing, I guess, for the rest of the map. But I can't really use him anymore. Uh, he has 7 move. You have 7 move too, that's really unfair. But that's why we gave him the Iron Axe, so he could get rid of them. Get out of here. I feel like these bandits spawned way too early. Normally they come, like, turn 10 or something. Oh, nice, Marty. Very cool. Very cool. Luna is waiting for you, my guy. Okay, so these guys, six move, but they ignore terrain, I feel like, when they move. This, yeah, okay. That's gonna be annoying. Hopefully they'll attack him. If not, I mean, they don't even double him, so he should be fine in the forest. Okay, I'm assuming Marty's gonna... Or... Arn is gonna ruin us. Oh boy, he did, like, no damage. We have the Rape here, though, which could be helpful. I don't have it on her, but I have it on Leaf, I think. I give that to you. Because I've heard Rapier Avel mix is a lot less painful, and I'm assuming it's because of this part here. Okay, she actually does damage with that, that's great. So, we're gonna enemy phase one of these. Uh, preferably... I'm not gonna give each other charm no matter what. Let me check if what happens if I hit him, if I hit him at range with uh, with Jan. If he's gonna get, if he's gonna get like, 99 move or whatever. Oh, good crit. Very helpful. <laughs> that's gonna make a huge difference. Thanks, uh, thanks Jan. Your contributions are appreciated as always. Except that it's like ammo. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought might end up happening, okay? Okay, so what I might do is, um... Enemy phase him with the rapier, I think. Hold up. I don't save state, there we go. Enemy phase him with the rapier, then next turn bait him into, um, getting himself captured by Tanya. Or, uh, capturing Tanya or something. Or, like, Safi, that's fine too. 
Uh, we might have to disarm both to make sure he goes for the right one. So, put Avel here. I mean, maybe she'll kill him one round. I don't know. Probably not. This could have been nice to have, too. Okay, how do we take care of this guy? This guy's always annoying, even in vanilla. Uh, I guess Finn might be okay at him. I kind of want to cap him for his vulnerary. Yeah, it looks like that's pretty accurate. So... Yeah, I guess I'll do. I'll go for that. That seems fine to me. If he misses, it's not the biggest deal in the world. I just feel like I'm gonna need it. Goodbye. I really wish I got the Killer Axe from Chapter 1. Or uh, Chapter 2. That's something I am really missed out on, I think. Okay, Halvin has some space. Right now, at least. Uh, take... 3. And uh, move you up. Should be ready to disarm Tanya, so I guess I might as well do it now. Although, I don't want her to be in range of that soldier right now. That's way too much movement. I wonder what Dactyl's gonna do now that he's an enemy. I kinda feel like this guy's unfairly restricting my ability to go literally anywhere. Oh, nice one, Lipis. That's that's good. That means I might get him to be able to open the door. That's cool. Okay, that's pretty much everyone, yeah. I, it says I can't move Dactyl, but I can't, so... Dactyl, good luck. Okay, good. He's trying to capture Safi, but I think he just realized he has no weapons. Oh, that's annoying as a vulnerary. That's... I mean... whatever. We'll, we'll, we'll deal with it. Okay, here comes the first Arden. He doesn't have a quote, he just straight up attacks me. But remember, Avel is invincible. So, this is a no-stakes battle. Yes. Okay, now he has extra move. Now we have to kill him, or make him capture bait. One of those two things. But a Dark Mage hasn't moved yet, which is good news for me. Hopefully he moves like turn 8, like in vanilla. Okay, I'm gonna kill one of these bandits, because I suspect they just don't even attack me. And if they keep going like this, they're gonna go for villages all the time. It's going to be very annoying indeed. And this gives him another shot at killing the soldier too. This is fine. Ideally, Dagdar like goes up to these brigands. And uh, annoys them to death. I still can't move Safi very far, but I do want her in range to heal people. I'm assuming she's important at some point to warp. I'm assuming warp exists at some point in this game. Right? Yeah, I can't steal anything from Arden even if I wanted to because he has 40 freaking speed. So I guess we just go for the kill, and if we don't get it, that's fine. But she should theoretically crit, I think. Nice vantage, but you can't hit her. Like, 97 hit, it's not gonna hit her. It's fine. Goodbye, get out of here. No! I missed! I should have crit, but I missed. I get quadrupled too, <laughs> that's cute. Okay, now this guy is gonna capture somebody. For sure. Actually, he can't reach anyone except Marty and Avel, which is very bad news, because... Um... That means he's probably gonna go for Marty and just bloody murder him. So... Can I put Tanya in his range somehow? Uh, I think there's a way, actually. It's kind of convoluted, but if it works, it works, right? How much build do you have, Tanya? Is 7. Is 11. So we can't carry her without moving speed. Because in this game, if you carry someone that has um, half or more of your weight, so for example, early constitution, that example, Orson has 11 build, and Tanya has 7, so if Orson carries Tanya, um, half of Orson's build would be like 5 or 6, which is less than Tanya has, so Tanya would slow him down. And what I want to do is, ca is rescue drop Tanya in range of Arden up here, uh, which I can't really use Orson for, but I can use Jan, I think. Go here, um, trade her things to her, didn't already? Yeah, trade her things to Jan, pick her up. And then drop her with Finn, one above where Finn is currently. That should work. So we trade with her. Take her stuff. Safe state in case I mess up the menu option. Rescue. And then we just drop her where where um, where Finn is, basically. Uh, take and drop. That should get Arden to come here and capture her. And then we can take care of him with, like, I don't even know what. The Brave Axe, maybe. I don't know. Maybe the light brand. We'll, we'll have to put a lot of measures here, but the point is we can do it. The point is that we can do it. Halvin, probably not going to be too useful at that. And as long as Avel is here on this choke point, we should, we should be okay. But next turn, like, two Arden's are going to activate, and that's going to be a little scary. And by a little, I mean very. Um, so I'm not sure how we're going to handle that. Okay, here. That's Dagdar following me around. That's fine. Yep, here he comes. Here he comes. Okay, he grabbed Tanya. That's fine. Hopefully, Avel can kill one of these soldiers. 
Actually, it would be okay if one of these soldiers survived, because then they choke point off the Ardents. I would prefer to face only one Ardent at a time. I know it can't be picky in a situation like this. I kind of want to steal that Fire Tone when I've Mage. But something tells me that's being a little too greedy about it. Oh, I really wish we killed this guy. Because I don't know where the Bandit's gonna go. Uh, I hope I didn't put Safi in his range. I purposely tried to avoid doing it, but I think I might have failed. Okay, Abel's very low on HP, but that's fine. She can't die. He's got that miracle going on. Okay, goes for Dakar, that's fine. Only the only thing is he's range of Safi now. I mean, I guess theoretically, I don't really want Dakar to die. But he might be fucked in. Oh boy, wait, wait. Uh huh? Oh, fortify, right, he does that. Oh god, that's annoying. Now if I want to kill this soldier, I have to use a Steel Axe, but I don't even care. I want to kill this bandit. He's more important. I'm going to use the, um, the Steel Axe, because I want to kill the soldier on enemy face. So Steel Axe. Hopefully I kill the soldier. I mean, I could trade Zappy's things away, but Marty's already full, so someone else would have to take her stuff. And only no one is in range of her. I don't want... I mean, I could capture this guy with Marty in theory, I guess. It's fine. I want to heal Marty, kind of, because if he, if he misses this guy once, he's dead, but whatever. We'll just save state and pretend it didn't happen. Okay, so over here, can we kill this Arden somehow? Well, we... The good news is we sort of do damage, I guess. Oh, we got fortified. Shit, that's so bad. That's so bad. Okay, let's see how much damage Finn does. He has, like, a good chance to survive just thanks to Miracle, I think. Yes, that's what it is. That's what it is. Let's go. I really have a feeling that Weapon Triangle works in this game, but I'm not sure. Feels like it does way more than 5%. Like, Finn's accuracy difference between, like, versus slants and axes is so big. Uh, like, Brad, how much does that do? 24. This guy's gonna run away, isn't he? Yeah, he's gonna run away with Tanya, too. Bad. I actually need, need Ava over here to take care of him before he runs away, I think. I wonder where he goes if he's trying to run away. Where would his, his escape point even be? I don't know. I could just run away from these Arnas. They're not- they don't move very far. But I can move Abel here and take care of business. I should probably even reset for a movement like star and try to take care of this Arnas now before he runs away. I think I should do that. Because if I don't, it's gonna be much harder next turn. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. There we go. That took a while, but we got it. Alright, let's go Abel. Take the forest, hopefully crit this guy. Get him out of here. This is fine, this is fine, let's go. Crit, crit, crit. Yes! Good work, Avel. Okay, it's one of them taken care of. Two more to go. I should rescue drop her closer, have her take on another one if I can. And it looks like from movement range, it looks like I can. So, let's do just that, shall we? So we take her with Finn and go here. Oh, wait, I wanna go. Yeah, I wanna go. Let's see, they move one, so one of them is gonna move down here and attack here. So we wanna drop there. I reckon. So we'll use, uh, we'll use Orson for this, I guess. Can he do that? Yes. Hey, oh, this is Halvin, whatever. No, he can't, he can't. Um, Orson's the same build. Okay, we have to use Jan then, that's fine. Take. Up. Uh, put Leaf in range for support. Uh, maybe we can bait the soldier into attacking someone else. Doesn't look like it. That's fine. Tanya in here. It's going to bait again. Maybe it should, she should even be like around here, around there somewhere, but we can always drop her there. And, you know, with Jan getting a movement star, we can actually heal Marty and then rescue her out, I think. Go here, drop Jan here, and then moves one, two. And uh, she goes here, one, two, and she should be. Not, a, not, yeah, she's in range. That sucks. But if she moves down instead. No, it doesn't really work either. Yeah, I'm afraid Marty is just gonna have to hit on enemy face. <laughs> I'm afraid that's how it'd be. Uh, I'll get her ready to rescue drop someone else out if need be. Or... Uh... Actually, I think what I'm gonna do is this, right? So we trade some of Jan's stuff to Lithus. And then we have Jan... Take some stuff from Safi. Oh wait, we can't take all our stuff though. Never mind, this is a dumb idea. This was a dumb idea. Okay, what I wanted to do was use Jan 
to take sappy stuff and then heal, but I can't take her heal staff away and then have her heal, because then she can't heal without a heal staff, so that, that doesn't work. Okay, I realized I probably have to redo my position a little bit, but should be fine. Should be A-OK. -okay. Leave for supports. We'll leave Tanya here. That was probably better anyway. And then we'll just, we'll see what we have to do for the rest of the turn, right? Get more bandits, that's fine. We can take that. Okay, please crit, Avel. Please crit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. She got an adapt, I guess, which is okay, but not exactly what I wanted. You know, maybe what I should do is have them capture bait first before they, you know, get to move away. Now this, this asshole's gonna move all over the place again. Okay, good level up for Marty again, as expected. Now we can heal him. Now we can heal him. We're definitely gonna do that. Heal him up. We can go for another round. Please don't miss. I didn't check what our skill is, but... Wow, he has so much HP. Holy shit. 49 HP in Chapter 3. Imagine that. Okay, 60 magic too. That helps. I love the skill. She actually cannot miss it. The formula is the same as in Vanilla. Yeah, I'll put him in range. I'm not expecting him to work out like that, but... Put him in range. And uh, this guy's gonna move all over the place again. We can actually keep everyone out of his range, and we'll see where he goes. He might attack Ethel anyway. That would be good if he did that. So let's try attacking. Hopefully he dies. I'm not expecting it though. I think I need a crit for him to die. Is it me or am I doing more damage now? Very curious. Okay, whatever. Like, is there a stat difference? Or defense? I don't see a difference. Anyway, he can get Tanya, but I don't think there's a reason to let him capture Tanya right now. Like, he only has 30 move, so he has to move like all the way around here, and that's why he can't reach very far. His force in the way, too. But he'll just be forced to attack Aethel again, and that's perfectly fine with me. Uh, I can even get some chip in with Jan. I don't know how useful it'll be, but you know, every point can matter, and it's XP no matter what, right? So let's get that XP. The javelin hit in too. I mean, the minimum damage is one apparently, just like an FE4. And if nothing else, it's, you know, a couple points of XP on Finn and stuff. Right? Oh my god. Oh, huh? Oh, right, you can go for Marty. Oh shit. No, Marty! Marty, no! Oh, he got captured. <laughs> but he has like all, all the stuff is gone now. That's very bad. And we can't capture him back with Dark Dark like we did back in Chapter 1. Okay, that's bad. We can't do that. I forgot the other side existed as well. Oh, that's bad. I already moved here. Let me check my save states. Okay, always, if you're abusing save states, always have one at the start of your turn. Always have one at the start of your turn, okay? So we don't, you can't have Marty go here. And since he can't be in range of the enemies anyway, it's fine. Like, the enemies don't attack him on enemy phase anyway, so it's fine to keep him here for a turn and then just attack a bandit next turn. Completely fine. Completely fine. Okay, I like this map a lot more than the last one so far. Okay, so we're we're, gonna, we're still gonna chip this guy and everything, but this time we won't put Marty in his range. Okay, that was my fault. That was my fault. This is fine. You get the same XP for missing as you do for hitting in Thracia, as long as you're like... As long as you're fighting and not killing an enemy, you get the same XP. Okay, those misses, I mean, unfortunate, but what can, what can you do, right? Maybe Ava will crit now. RNG changes so easily that this kind of difference can easily happen. On Avel. Oh my god. So bad. So bad. Why is he so fast? Okay, I'm gonna turn animations off for this part. It's taking a while, it's taking a while. Okay, here he goes. Oh, I forgot to move Tanya out of range. I'm so dumb. Be right back. <laughs> there we go. Now we got him. Now we got him. Uh, I mean, and by got him, I mean totally fucked ourselves. But you know, we put uh, we we let Arden take get the forest. Very bad idea indeed. Stupid, stupid Arden. Oh, the other one moved. Okay, so I think what happened here 
is this Arden usually moves first, and he checked and he couldn't see the space to attack her from. Like, he can't move in the forest because he's only got one move and he gets a forest penalty. And the space was occupied by this Arden, so he couldn't go there. Uh, so he decided, okay, I'm gonna wait, but it doesn't actually show him graying out when he waits. And then he moves, and uh, the rest is history. So, now the question is, what can he reach this time? And the answer is pretty much the same things. Again, if we move Marty in, he's a dead man. Uh, so I think it's time to move away Safi. Uh, fortunate as it is, we, we're gonna lose our healing assistant here. And um, we're just gonna have to kill these guys by hand. And again, we have to oh, we have to kill this Arden now so hard. I really need a crit here, I think. If we don't get a crit now, I think I'm pretty much toast. God, this guy's annoying. Kill! Yes! That's right, that's right, that's what I needed. Okay, now, we're, we're ready for action. Uh, we might even... Yeah, we might get to this other soldier, too. I don't think I'm gonna need this, but whatever, it's fine. Get him. Get him. Yes! Freelancers. Hashtag freelancers. Freelancers. Wait, hello, there we go. Take this lance. We'll give it to Finn. Gotta find the train command again. Okay, we gave Finn the steel lance or whatever it is that he had. That's good. Okay, next beam. We're gonna try to have him capture first. And then we're gonna let him attack us. Actually, if we do that, he's gonna run away. That's a bad idea. That's a bad idea. I think his stat's not gonna do very much. We're gonna let him attack us, then capture Tanya, and then attack him again with all we have. That's the plan for now. Uh, these guys can't reach me. Uh, I would like to kill one. Marty can't attack him yet, so that's a good idea. Do that. Kill one of these. Wait, that's the... This, this is the one we want to attack. Right? Yeah. Um, Iron X. Yep. This is fine. Keep those those villages safe. Oh, we got the axe rank. That's good, I guess. He has B rank axes. I don't know what that does for him. I think I think it lets you use master axes. I don't know what Dactar thinks he's doing. I guess he just can't find anyone to attack, so he's just chilling. Okay. All right. Crit. Go. Oh shit. No crit. That's bad. Okay, so now it's capture time. Okay, go for Dactar. That's that's actually perfect. That's exactly what I want. Back them from the villages. Kill these guys one by one. I like how they just don't even attack, even if you're like right next to them. This one is the furthest getting to the villages. At some point, maybe Dr. will get surrounded by four and I'm gonna actually have to worry about the villages again. But for now, this seems like a good distraction. Marty kills one every turn. So we're gonna last about three to four turns here on our own. Okay, so now we let this guy just capture Tanya, I guess. Uh, I will attack from here. Or maybe even from above. We need lethal range for support though. So we'll go like here. We'll hit him with a light brand. I don't know how much it's gonna do. I probably shouldn't even do that. I think I might need to use Slayer. I'm gonna regret that very much. Uh, so Avel from here, because Avel supports Leaf and vice versa. So important to have him in range. Damn, imagine doubling with a freaking Brave Sword. Too good. Uh, I wonder what will happen if I surround him completely. I think I'll just attack someone and murder them, probably. Uh, if I had to guess, that would be my bet. So, get as many hits on him as possible. We'll even surround him if he wants to move away or something. I do want people to go indoors eventually. That would be very nice. Alright, good crit, good crit. Wear him down, wear him down. Wear him down as much as possible. Throw a hand axe, why not? Get the XP. Everything we can at him. Everything we can. Let's go. Take that. Yes. Take that too. Okay, I'm really gonna be annoyed by that Dark Mage once he opens the chests. That's what I'm afraid of. That doesn't take too long to kill the Ardens, but... You know, you can't really... Kill him any faster, I feel like. Unless you get lucky with Rapier crits. Okay, you got Tanya as expected. And now his AI should be... Telling him to run away, I think. Yeah, just keep going, guys. Keep going. Yeah, that's right. Try going for Dactar. It won't, it won't work. I wonder how long these reinforcements will last. I think if I kill the boss, they're going to be gone, but that is going to be a thing of its own, you know? Okay. Um, well, this time we have to get a rapier crit, I think, to get a move on. So, let's go for one. We do 19 damage now because his defenses have. So, crit, let's go. 
God, Arden, you're so annoying. Crit. Crit. Yes, that's right. That's right. That's right. We got him. Good job, Tanya. You're very useful. You're very useful. Okay, I'm gonna take this guy out with um, Jan or something. She could probably take him. She has Wrath. Uh, if you get hit... Yeah, this should leave her in Wrath range if, you get, if she gets hit a lot. If not, she'll be safe anyway. This is not an Arden. This is a normal Armor Knight. Yeah, that's right. Good job, Jan. Got him. Get him out of here. Okay, Lithus can open the door, right? Uh, not quite. Maybe with a Movement Star? Or we can use the door key with, like, Tanya or something. That works, too. Let me find a door key real quick. Oh, we have all the too. That could work. Okay, yeah. We should give that Killing Edge to Leaf, I reckon. I think Finn can't go indoors on this mountain this. Even, like, he can't do it in vanilla, so he probably can't do it here. But he can't use this yet. That sucks. Maybe Aethel could have used that. Well. Um... Yeah, we'll get a movement start on Lithus. Fuck, I safe stayed it. <laughs> fuck. I'm bad. Okay, we're just gonna have to trade over the door key then. Oh, fuck. Give me the door key. Just give me the door key. Just... Give me the door key. Uh, you can take the steel lance, I guess. Whatever. I'm gonna do a bunch of inventory management when I'm done with this. Trade. Get the door key. There you go. And then, um... I mean, Leaf doesn't have his rapier anymore. I think we have another one on Lithus. Can't get over here anyway. So I guess maybe Lightbrand is gonna have to be the solution to this guy. Seems good enough. Might have to dismount Finn. Please add it. No? Okay. Fine. Yeah, Finn is gonna have to dismount now. This command. There you go. And we're gonna have to carry some kids home. I feel like I need everyone indoors ASAP. Just because of um, the... Well, not the boss. There's probably gonna be something going on indoors that I'm gonna have to take care of. But maybe someone like Orson should go outside and kill the brigands first. I have a feeling some of them are about to escape. Yeah, I think I'll, I'll do that. I think I'll have Orson deal with some brigands. Because they just keep coming and they won't stop coming. I need Aethel to kill the boss. Preferably before reinforcements arrive, because I know they exist even in Villa, so they will here. I'm half expecting another bunch of Ardens. Oh, you're attacking Tanya. Kind of weird, because she has no weapons, so you should be capturing her. Maybe he doesn't have to build for it. Probably doesn't. Alright. Whatever, bro. Oh, this guy has to actually attack me now. That's interesting. Before they didn't attack me. Weird. Well, I'll welcome it. That's perfectly fine with me. Makes it easier to keep the villages safe. Okay, this guy didn't attack me. Yeah, I just didn't have to build to capture me. That's why I didn't. Okay, fair enough. Uh, we can't kill this guy with Leaf. We have to move her out of the way. Uh, we can kill him with uh, Alvin or something. Or this is Orson, actually. I love how I keep confusing them, even though they're very different in this. Uh, you all suck. Uh, Jan can actually chip in here. What if we do this? Get in with Halvin and then kill with Jan. I like that. We need to dismount uh, Jan this turn, I think. Okay, let's get him. Uh, dismount. And attack. The kill, right? Yep. Good. Very good. Oh man, I like this character actually. They're, I mean, they're no Ronan, but they're still pretty fun. You're gonna go down, fight some brigands probably. Uh, you're gonna go up. I don't know how much her staff rank matters. She has C rank now, which is just like vanilla. In vanilla is like very important to train her. I don't know about if that's the case for this. You go in your good old iron sword, I think. I'm tired of wasting life brand on things I don't have to. There we go. That's my reward. We're not hoarding, or whatever it is. Uh, Finn can go in. Finn seems pretty bad with Brave Lance indoors. I think it just weighs him down too much. 13 speed though. Not bad actually. Uh, it, does, it actually doubles this guy. So. I'm gonna try using the Steel Lance instead, which is... Lighter, actually. Maybe this is not a Steel Lance. Maybe this is an Iron Lance. Okay, whatever. Point is, we're equipping it. And you're gonna go open the door to the kids. I'm hoping none of them will, like, jump out and kill me. I kind of could see that happening. 
Uh, we'll heal Tanya. Or, uh, Gan, for whatever it's worth. Because uh, I have a feeling I'm about to get hit by a... By a long-range tome soon. Like, I know that's the case of Vanilla, and it's like... The only way it could be different is if it's worse somehow. Soldiers on the move. I feel be proactive here by taking this guy out. Oh wow, that's that that glit that sprite kind of glitched here, but that's okay. All right, Doctor still doing his distractorinos. Uh, did this guy even move? I feel like he just stayed there and didn't do anything. I'm guessing this guy is programmed to attack me, and he couldn't because my defense is too high. No, that's not it. Because uh, he would do four damage. Okay, I'm gonna hit this guy. Let's see if it happens again next turn. <coughs> Very surprised by how easy this has been to keep him around. Okay, we'll put Orson in his range, maybe that'll change his mind. Um, we'll put the Iron Axe. Uh, leaf. Out here. And fight, maybe trade the Red Gear, but nah, fuck it. We'll just use the Iron Sword. That's fine. And we'll have Lifus open this door actually, and we'll have. I would like to capture this guy, because he has a lot of good things, like... I don't know what exactly this is, looks like Jormungandr to me. Uh, maybe he'll kill Lifus with it, that would be bad. Um, but we'll, we'll put Ava on the train, maybe we'll, she'll go for him. Very good, okay, well, let's try to capture this guy. Uh, Silver Sword? That looks really good, actually. Let's try this. Get out of here. Okay, that's some more goods for me. We're on turn 10. I think normally he gets he goes for the chest in like turn 8 in vanilla, so I'm kind of surprised he didn't do it already. Uh, Finn probably best off used outdoors. Uh, I'm sure Leaf can handle this, right? We'll have Finn stay outdoors. He's going to be ready to risk the kids. Uh, we'll have Leaf us open his door next turn. I think we're looking okay. I think we're, we got this covered. Um, she should be handy to have indoors as well as outdoors. Not sure yet. I'm going to have her help Leaf out. Finn should go back outdoors. Mount's gonna rescue kids with him next turn. Uh, he's gonna rescue kids for sure. Uh, she should heal. For whatever use it is. Good. I can help carry kids as well. We'll line them up. See how it goes. I'll probably not do all the carrying of kids on screen unless something exciting happens. Leaf can get some juicy XP here. Got a nice choke point going on. Okay, this, this guy did run past me, but Orson is ready, you know. Uh, I don't know where he's going next. Maybe he'll go like beyond the bushes. That could be very bad, so we'll just um, you know, I brave axe him just in case something goes very wrong. Don't want to have Orson play catch up when he can't catch up and break a crit next turn or something. That seems kind of tedious. This guy. This has been a great chapter for experience for Marty. He's gonna be so ready for whatever the game throws at me. Probably not. Probably not. Love to heal Leaf, but I can't heal a one. And nope. Nope. I guess there's not going to be too much healing here. I would like to have Avil take this guy... Have this guy taken off her by someone. Uh, Livis can't do it. I think his build is too low. He only has four in this, which I just noticed. Uh, if Vanilla has like six or seven base, I think, so he can steal tomes. Not the case here. Uh, I have three spots between two of them. One here. And a lot of the side. Okay, I, I figured it out. Uh, trade... Take these things for a moment. Go here. Take these. And release. And we're gonna fight the boss next with Avel. I want him gone ASAP. And I don't trust this game with bosses. Can we kill this guy? Probably. Yeah. Okay. He's no Ronan, but I really like her anyway. He's really nice to have. Let's weaken this guy. Fight attack Jan. Okay, never mind. Okay, cool. Alright, this is, uh... This seems doable right now. Kinda not sure what's supposed to be happening after this. 
Okay, these guys just stopped attacking Dagdar. I don't know why, but it scares me. <laughs> it really scares me. Um, maybe they can be tricked into capturing Tanya though. I put Tanya here also because she supports um, Orson. Uh, this is kind of scaring me actually. Because uh, I don't know if I can kill them all in time. Okay, that helps. That helps a lot. Level up for Orson. Yeah, I might need help stopping them. So they they stop going for Dagdar. Okay, let's try to see if we can kill the boss, alright? Uh, I know his tome is like infinite might or whatever, but... I'm sure we can get the job done. Uh, let's turn on animations for this fight. Let's see how it goes. I think he has like stone or some kind of... other spell. It has no might from what I can tell. It has crit... Uh, let me check the order of these things again. We have a rape here. 100 hit. 8 might. 30... Right? I don't even know. We'll see how it goes, I guess. We'll put Leaf in range. Get support. Let's get him. It sounds like Raedric music. Wow, she does a shit ton of damage. I wonder how I'm gonna kill bosses without her around. There's no doubt I'm gonna lose her. Just like Vanilla. Okay, that did okay. I wonder what he's gonna do now. Lift is gonna open this door. Fucking chests. I'll have either nearby. We should actually go for this, but whatever. Fine. We can do this off screen, it's fine. It's just keep coming, jeez. Oh god, what happened here? Oh, nothing. Nothing, right? Nothing happened, right? Did something come up? I didn't see anything. But that, that, that little camera pan to the right, that kind of scared me. Okay, it looks like Marty's still doing okay here. I don't know what the bandit AI is like, but hey, whatever. Whatever works for them, right? Okay, went for the capture. That's, that's as I hoped. This guy attacked me. That's also good. Go ahead and hit me, I don't care. Yep, even doubles. I don't think he has the Brave Axe equipped. I think he has an Iron Axe. He should have an Iron Axe. Okay, Birdo attacking me. Okay. Oh, uh, wait, he went for Leaf. Oh. Huh. Oh, he has Hell. Oh, I see. Okay, that's kind of bad, but... I forgot he had 3 range. That's my bad. <laughs> that's my bad. Okay, Leaf, you're okay? You're, you're okay there, bud? You're not poisoned or anything? I think we're fine. Okay. Let's uh, capture Reno him, or kill him actually. Go Avel. Okay, interesting that he has hell. I didn't notice it was that. But I don't really, I'm not very good at recognizing animations, so that's why. Cool animation though. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay, we killed the, we killed, we killed the final boss. We win, right? We won, I think. I bet he says something along the lines of, uh, I've been defeated, I must retreat. I'm pretty sure the last lines was him like laughing, like ha 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 ha. Yeah, it was a bunch of the same characters. Okay, um... I'm gonna do, as long as nothing else happens, I'm gonna do the rest off screen. And by the rest I mean like finding these guys, um, getting the treasure, carrying the kids home. If something exciting happens, you know, I'll have it on camera, but I don't feel like elaborately commentating it. Uh, this is important though, I guess. So we got a meteor, that's here in vanilla too, so that's good to have. I'm assuming it's meteor. 410 range. Interesting. 50 hit? Okay. Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> okay, game. Okay. Interesting. How much crit was that? Alright. Okay, cool. That's that's very fair and balanced. Yeah, cool. I like it. I like it a lot. I was just trying to feed the kill to him, and then he just randomly crit more of death. Interesting. Interesting. Very cool. Very cool game. Fuck this guy, man. This guy's stupid. Die. There we go. What am I level up? Is that so difficult? Come on, game. Don't be so rude. Okay. I killed the boss, so everything should stop coming now. Let's see what's in the other chests. 
Uh, Armor Slayer? Yeah, that's the same as vanilla, right? Okay, um, I assume he just sends it to Convoy. I'll... I'll send the... German Gondor. I'm assuming it goes to Convoy. There's a Convoy right here. I'm gonna check it out. I'm gonna manage a bunch of my inventory. <laughs> they gave the kids, like, four builds, so Lifus can't carry him. <laughs> what a dick move. Alright, we got Corporal Home. That's the one I recognize. One problem is that this guy and um, this guy actually look the same, so I have no idea what house to take them to, and the names are in Japanese, so I can't read them. But uh, hopefully I won't get penalized for taking them to the wrong house or anything. Uh, I think one of them is here. I think so, yeah. Okay, let's try that. Okay, let's try Marty to this house here. That's not the right house, so we're not going there. We're going, uh, we're going downtown. So that means you actually need to be here, and you need to go down. Okay, that should be the right one. Okay, we got the shield ring. I think. Pretty sure that's the shield ring. Yeah, plus two defense. I think. Good to me. And then this one should be uh, Yuvel's house, so that should be Dash and Son. I keep waiting for accidents. <laughs> Is it? Okay, looks like it. Uh, that should let us record dashing later. And now all we have left is Rosa, or whatever her name is. And that's Rosa, and we get the scroll. Okay, we got something different. I haven't seen any scrolls yet. Well, Livis didn't have one. You should touch her first. I don't know what this does. Looks like a Draco shield of some kind. Um, maybe if this is... No, it can't be a Draco. I don't know what it is. I'll have to ask. But uh, I'll figure it out for sure. Uh, by the time this video goes live, I'll probably know already. But you're welcome to tell me in the comments, I guess. So now all that's left to do is item management, which I'm gonna do like off screen too. Uh, there's a convoy here, I'm gonna dump some things in. I know I'm gonna disarm uh, Halvin, Tanya, and Dagdar. Apparently, that's like a very important thing to do. Uh, I already did it for Dagdar, of course, because he was gonna get berserked. And we'll see what anyone else is gonna do. Um, I plan to take. Uh, if I wanna know, I need to put the master items on Lifus and Leaf, like usual. And I think I'm gonna bring the Puji a rapier and a light brand and that should be enough but I, I'm apparently I'm, I'm allowed to take like more things than that in vanilla it's a good idea to not to do that but I don't know about here so I'm gonna take some time to think about that um, until then uh, I'll see you next time I'll show off my uh, my character stats I guess for the start of master so leaf is level 7 he's got these stats right here I don't really know what's good or bad in this power craft hack I feel like when you're up against soldiers this is fine and when you're up against artists this is bad so it's really relative to the situation but this is Leaf. Um, here's Safi. She's just going, so it doesn't really have anything to her yet. Um, we got Alvin, um, Lithis, Gan, um, Tanya, Orson, Finn, Dagdar with the Berserk status, uh, Marty, and uh, Avel. For what it's worth. And finally, the king of parties. Oh, we already showed off Marty, didn't we? Pretty sure we did. But anyway, this is the guy's the king right here. This is the king. Okay. So that's my unit stats right now. Um let me just seize and I'll see you guys next time. Actually let me prep and then I'll seize and I'll see you guys next time. So peace, goodbye. Love ya.